Hey guys, Wild Thing here, once again, for some more rocket mayhem. <laughs> Let's see what type of trouble we get into today. Hopefully my mods are working, because I made some adjustments. Um, and we shall see. Oh, that's today. Oh, these were last night. Wow, those are massive. Some big videos uh, <laughs> from last night that I got to upload still, but... That is not for right now. Let's see. Make sure you guys are hearing me. You are. That's awesome. Make sure that do that playback. <laughs> Channel created. All right. Perfect. Now let's see if I can load my open Mun Orbit Two load. Nice. So we fixed life support, which actually is a thing we need to be concerned about now. So, uh, where is life support? Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Um, yeah. We did fix life support, so. Nope, don't need that. three days worth of life support. I'm wondering if I send Jebediah up for three days or not. Actually, I think that's exactly what we're... We're going to do a brand new ship here. This is a non-science ship we're going to do. The whole focus on this ship is going to be to get Jebediah some levels, because Jebediah has not enough levels. Well, he has levels. That's not a problem. But So now you're seeing all these new things. But what we're going to do is very basic, very, very basic keep Jebediah alive uh, module here. Let's see, keep Jebediah am alive. And then what we'll do is, uh, oh, that's right, the rocketry ones are now working too. That's awesome. All sorts of new stuff is working here because we fixed some modules that were installed improperly. But that's okay. We need to get Jebediah levels. It's first and foremost on our list of things that need to get done. Uh, oh. Oh. The DM science module is working too. Oy, wow. All sorts of new and fun, exciting stuff going on here. But what we need right now is a life support container. Not just food. I want the multi. There's a multi here that gives us... All three supplies. It's super duper convenient and a lot easier to manage. So that gives us water, oxygen, and food. Now there's a waste container. I'm not sure we need to worry about that though. I think waste. I don't think waste is an issue for us. I think that will be more than enough. <clears throat> more than enough for the trip we're going to be taking, which is just to leave him up there for a little while. So I think we could do something like this. Nice small engine to help with uh, brake speed. We have our parachute there. Don't need communication. We do need, and I think I already researched it once. Couple solar panels, just to make sure we don't lose power. There we go. Probably super excessive, but not going to break anything. So we're just going to leave it. Oh, that's too big. Just right. Okay, now we're going to build in our lower stage.
build in a lower stage here to help us finish this launch. Where is it? There we go. Boom. Put some vehicle staging in, and we get to go. Okay. Do these. Equal fuel tanks on this one because we're going to stage them with some uh, stage them with some fuel lines so we can get the maximum out of this. How's that look? Wow. All right. Looks pretty good. We'll find out during launch when things going off on its own. Let's see, center of weight, thrust. Aerodynamics, okay. So, because for some reason I can't get over having fins, it's like, like I'm broken to have them. There we go. So, rockets, engines, 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 more engines. Oh, that's right, I had these, the rocket, uh, KW rocketry, but I'm not going to work with those because right now I don't need them. We know that this this will work. So we're going to launch, we'll fire all our engines at the same time because we can use thrust to control them. It gives a little more stability. We're saying that these, let's see, I don't need that stuff anymore. Hold on one second, guys. You can watch me launch rockets like everyone else, or everyone being the four people that are on the stream right now. Um, let's see. Oh, right now I'm just, I have to build it real quick. I need a, I need a rocket that's going to get my guy into space here. Pretty straightforward, so. That will easily happen with this guy, I think. Yeah, that's yeah, definitely going to happen, no doubt about it. So there, break those off, break those off, finish that burn, break that off, and then I have a little extra. Oh yeah, holy cow, thrust to weight ratio is off the, through the roof, right? I'm definitely not going to have a problem with getting, um, getting a Jebediah up in, uh, up into space. So. Um, Orbit one. That's what we're gonna call it. This is to train Jebediah how to, you know, pilot. Because I'm pretty sure if I put him up there and I have him <clears throat> and I have him orbit Kerbin for a couple days, I'm pretty sure he's gonna be super duper happy and have all sorts of good experience for us. And then I can launch up uh, another Kerbal either another pilot or maybe I send a scientist up and we'll do some uh, another mun flyby and get a little closer this time and do a couple other things because we could probably do that without having an actual pilot or we might 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 yeah we don't got it we don't have anything there one second guys sorry about that back um I probably do not need any antenna on this, but I'm thinking of an antenna just simply from the fact that I may want to have a little communication Mommy, capability. Uh, let's just see. 
Yeah, you know what? That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to throw just a simple antenna on this bad boy. That's cool. I've got more than enough. I've got more than enough. Um, more than enough to load an antenna onto this bad boy. Do a nice little commie train. Oh, I don't need two. Come on. One's perfectly fine. Since we're putting something on there. And I'll put a battery in there too. What the heck? Okey artichokey, what do we got here? What happened there with the staging? That's weird. Staging went all sorts of wonky on me. Oh, that's right, I disconnected the whole vehicle for a second. So, those break and those break. Okay, so bring those up there. Bring these down into the first stage. The guy takes off. Boom, 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 boom. Break off. Break off, break off. Perfect. huge amount of Delta V available to us, so I'm not going to have any issues getting this guy into space, into orbit here. Alright, Training Orbit 1. That's the name of the vessel. I know I don't have really good names of vessels, huh? But we'll make it happen. Alright, Jebediah. Oh, science! Nope. Nope. I think I'm missing something. I am. But there's nothing I can do about it. I'm missing the information on my life support. Like how much life support I have available to me. That's why. I think it was this janitor add-on that made it unavailable, but you know what? That's okay. It's okay. We'll be able to we'll be able to gauge that on our own. Okay. Um, another snow day. Yes, another snow day. Half the roads in the town I work in are closed, Nikki. So here I am launching rockets once again. Uh, yeah, I'm going to launch one, buddy. You want to watch? Yeah. Okay. Here, why don't you come hit the button? Watch that cord. Come over here. One second, guys. You got to press that button. Okay? Press it when you're ready to launch. Hit this one right here. Big one. This one. Press that one. Yeah. Launching. Ooh. Yeah. Woo is right, right? How much snow have you got? We received 21 inches of snow where I live. It was um, depressing and insane. Oh, mech jive them up. Okay, well that's interesting. I just have to deal with that. I I think I know if I press that again, that big button. Don't. If I press, don't, don't press it, it'll make it go back down and fall. No, it's gonna break off two of the engines. You'll see in a second. Here, watch. I'll work on mech jive in a second. Those are two of the engines that are falling off. Those are two of the engines that are falling off. Daddy's doing a roll here. I'm going to start turning. Doing our gravity turn. Oh, so what's a gravity turn? So gravity turn is turning in the direction of um, it's turning so that the ship can start moving in the direction of the orbit that we need to go on and we're using the gravity of the planet to, to pull the ship in that direction. So that's oh, why they call it a gravity oh, turn. So so, is that like that's what the I think it is. Earth? Um, it's a representation of Earth, and this planet is Kerbin, is the name of the planet that we are 
looking to um, orbit. So that's your guy? Mm-hmm. So your guy is in, in it right in the top. Yes. Well, right now I just took off from the planet, so. Yep. Oh, so you're now off to the planet? That's, that, that's the planet? Right, it is the planet. Now you're in outer space? Correct. Yeah. Alright, we want to get closer to our Apoapis before we keep burning, so that way we can not necessarily have an insane orbit here. And I'm really bummed out that this Wait isn't working. I might be having other add-on issues that I wasn't aware of, but that's okay. That is all right. We are going to make this work because we don't necessarily need neck jab. Okay, we are going to get that periapis up to snuff here. Yes, I realize I'm facing nearly straight down to the planet, but the whole point of that is because I do not want to have a super high apoapis. I want to have one that's perfect. Done. Mission accomplished, people. Mission accomplished. So we're going to leave Jebediah up here for a little while. Let Jebediah hang out, do his thing, while we um, orbit a little bit here. So we're going to go down to the Space Center. We're going to let Jebediah hang out up in space and get some experience while I look at two things. One, what is going on with this plugin that caused all of this nonsense to happen? Mod show blocked. No mods were blocked. Mod filter. Neck jab. Okay. It is turned on. Not showing up here. No. Hmm. I do not know. I don't know. Let's see, do we have any? Mike Jeff is there. I'm. I am guessing that I actually need to have Mech Jab trained now that I fixed the modules that were broken before. I think that's the problem. So, in the interest of having Mech Jab as an option, I'm going to train that real quick. Didn't I have aerodynamics? Must not have had that. Oh, or heavy rocketry, fuel systems, general construction. Oh, my aerospace domes are gone. Oh, no, they're not. They're right there, just in a different spot. All right, now that we reacquired Mech Jab, I think, let's just see if it actually something I can add to the ship and see for future references. Uh, utilities? Nope. Science? Nope. Uh, communication, electronic, or right, command and control, pods, nope. Where are the frack? Okay, there it is. Let's just see what this does when I put it on. Thought so. Oh, okay, so not ideal, but <clears throat> we'll make that work. So we've got our training orbit going on right now. We are going to, uh, don't save that. Do not save that. We're gonna go to the MUN orbit too, load that back up which we know will make it to MUN. We're going to, hold on one second, guys. All right. Run, we, run. Uh, 
All right. Uh, we are going to use a scientist, Bob. Bob is going to go to Mun for us, and we're going to do some science while we're up there. <clears throat> okay, so we're going to open this bad boy up, because now we need to throw mech jab in here, apparently. Can I put mech jab on top? Okay, I can, let's see. Well, I sure can put mech jab up top, awesome. Is there other science? Oh, electric. It's electric. I can't put it there, but I can see. That's weird. I think my tack life support module is not working properly. I think that's what the problem is. I'm not sure if there's a piece that I'm missing for this to work properly, or it's just that it didn't insert to this command module property. That is a bummer, because... But, that's okay. It's alright. We'll make do with that. We'll, we can make life support a thing. It's, uh, I think we're going to be fine with that. We're just going to throw on a quick life support module here. Well, you know what I didn't calculate? On a survivor... Do I need this waste container? I don't know. I don't know the answer to that. But then, oh no. Oh no. So we're going to check. We are going to check in our tracking station what's happening with this guy. Okay, Jebediah is not dead yet, that's good. I don't think this is working because this food, this would have already, would have already. This color will shine. Oh boy. When, um, so when you, so when you that, that it's a bummer. Like, not like, I don't like when the add-ons don't work. It makes life a lot harder here. Give me one second to see if I'm missing something here on this add-on that maybe I can add. Well, we'll work with what we got. Nothing much we can do about that here. Set shot.
I think this is good enough for now. Don't have to rethink the wheel on this one. Launch, break, break. There, there. And maybe some power. Maybe some power. Not again. I smell you. This is an impressive attempt at an orbit, but I am completely messing up. Oh my god. Sorry, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold the phone. There's mistakes, and then there are mistakes that just aren't unnecessary. So we're going to re retract that unnecessary mistake and give this another try here, because that was kind of silly. I forgot that I don't have a pilot. Wait, I don't have a pilot. I'm not supposed to have a pilot. Oh, that's yourself. That's All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Revert to vehicle assembly. I'm supposed to have a scientist in there. I guess I forgot to load him in. Bob, there you are. Now let's launch Bob up into space and do some science. 
Oh. You know what? what? Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Hang tight, guys. Hang tight. Oh, his health is going down much. Hmm. I'm getting his health. Hmm. Oh, here's the belly. Oh, they can't call other stuff. Oh, he's a belly. Oh. Got his super speed. Oh, he's the last. Broken add-ons. Broken add-ons. All right, I have to recover this guy. Got to recover this guy. I have to save the game, and I have to fix an add-on here. I just can't ignore it any longer. So I will be right back here with this game as soon as I fix the add-on that I broke, apparently. All right, so there is a science add-on that apparently, for whatever reason, I decided to break. <laughs> and I'm going to go fix it right now. I don't know why I broke it the first time, but I did. I 100% did. Almost done. Sorry. I realize that it might take longer than a second here, but I just need to fix the one or two that I broke in the process of thinking that I was fixing stuff. Oh no, the cook has gone mad. He's making muffins for his dinner. Okay, so that. This is not going to be installed on the right spot. Some of these add-ons that I have here for the game, they're not getting installed in the right spot, which is why they're not working.
It's just a bucket. Oh, that goes over to that. Almost done. Almost done. Almost done. Almost done. Where did that next one go? Man, no wonder these aren't working. They're on the wrong spot. That's very uncomfortable. <coughs> It just moves forward. You can't like stop. I might not play this. Yeah, I'm not playing. Let's see what's right there. All right, now let's get this game back up and running that we've made a couple of alterations here, and Lord willing, we did not break poor Jebediah, who's flying up there all by himself right now. Uh, did I have this one installed, too? I think I did have this one installed. I sure did have that one installed, and now it's not installed, so we're going to install it again. Do you mean Gamer Girl? Yeah. Sure did have that one installed. Almost done. One more minute, guys. I promise. Just downloading one more add-on that I thought I had here that's no, it wasn't working anymore. So, um, stop. Green. Perfect. Done. Okay, now where's that last one? Alright, looks like it went into the right spot. Let's see what happens now when I load this up. Hopefully I didn't break everything. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. All right, I think we fixed the add-on problem. I sure hope we fixed the add-on problem. It'd be nice to actually play the game instead of be futzing around with plugins and add-ons and all this other nonsense, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. Hold on. So we load back in here.
really hope Jebediah's flight was not compromised by my add-on updates because it's one of the negatives of this game is that that could happen. So we're going to go to the tracking center. We're going to check in on Jebediah real quick. Jeb. Jeb, how we doing, Jeb? Let's see. Is Jeb still alive? Jebediah is still alive. It's a good sign. Mech Jab is up and running. Nope. 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 Let's see. Okay, we're accounting for it there. I still don't see our, the fuel system. I should be honest with you, I don't really see. Let's see. Maybe electric charge will come back after. Let's just double check something real quick. No, we're not drawing any electric charge either. Oh, that's a bummer. So some of this add-on is working, and some of this add-on is just like, I am not going to work with you. Hey, how's it going, Silent? Silence. Yeah, no, I'm I'm actually trying to get the uh, life support add-on to work, but I think it's completely broken due to the most recent update because I cannot get my Kerbal to actually eat, drink, or breathe, apparently. <laughs> So there's that. So we're just gonna have to deal with that, unfortunately. I can't. What's up, Deck? I assume Deck. Maybe not Deck. Whoa. What up, Deck? We made a new channel. I did. I figured it made a lot more sense to have a streaming did you channel. Lock it? No, I didn't lock it. It's just more of a hey, heads up if you're in this channel. I'm, and I'm in this channel. Oh, there you go. I just made it permanent. Yeah. Yeah, I can't get this life support add-on to work. It's kind of a bummer. You can revert to if you want to the mod. Hmm. That's a really good point. I didn't think about that. I could revert to 131 and then run with the mods I want. But you know what? The expansion's coming out next week. Which is probably going to break everything. And I don't think I want to wait for that. So. I mean, I could. So I have... A two foot wide by three foot high pile of boulders in front of my driveway. Boulders, huh? Yeah, well, because it's, the plow came through at about 3.30 in the morning last night. So now I'm debating whether I drive through it or I try to make my snowblower go through it. <laughs> There's no way I'm moving it with a shovel. I would try out my snowblower, personally. All right, let's get this science going here, though. Try this one more time. Yeah, somehow I busted up my ankle yesterday and didn't even realize it must have been too cold outside and uh -huh. too focused on snow. Yeah, I woke Gross. up this morning, tried to get out of bed, almost fell. <laughs> that sounds painful. Morning, Nikki. Morning, everyone else that's here. Oh, no I SS still pretty bad. SES modules and no, I kind of forgot without Did a pilot, I would need, no, I just have to oh. add the SAS module. I forgot that I don't have a pilot. I was going to bring up just a scientist to do science to bring up their level. I already have Jebediah orbiting, <laughs> orbiting <laughs> Kerbin. Um, Your stream still says player unknown battlegrounds. Does it? On my screen it does, yeah. No, refresh. Refresh. Oh, okay. Let's, let's uh, do that. Let's I bet you we can do this without SAS. What's the worst that's going to happen? Well, let's go back here. Well, the worst that's going to happen is that Bob won't there make it and we revert the flight. <laughs> Realism. <laughs> Are we going to have casualties? Um, The vessel like might not things. make it. We'll see. I'm told that... Bob has a parachute though, so you know there's that. Let's just see what happens in this takeoff first. Smaller adjustment. 
adjustments. Forgot I don't have SAS on. take certain things for granted until you don't have them. I really took SAS for granted and a pilot for granted, apparently. It's okay, though. We're gonna make it work. We're gonna make it work. Oh, I really, 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 really just took a pilot for granted, but I was able to at least get up into orbit, albeit a horrible orbit, and I have zero idea if I'm actually going to be able to get to Mun, but such is life. We will try. See if I can adjust this orbit now to do what I need to do. Let's see, we're going to, while having enough fuel to get back. I think I can, because I had a lot of fuel the last time I attempted this. Let's closest approach. See if I can adjust my angle here. Nope. Like that. Uh, like that. Two degrees, huh? Point two, I should say. Oh, that's the wrong way. Do I have target information on this or something? No, I don't have target information, never mind. It's the best I'm gonna be able to do. that would hit Mun, which is not ideal. So let's slow this down a little. We really want to come in back. Ideally we want to come behind Mun. Ooh. 
Okay. So I, I just heard we we have another yep. nor'easter another... scheduled for Monday. Yeah, just heard that too. I want to cry. <laughs> Jeez. I want to cry. I want to cry. Jeez. Because I can't even fathom the idea of even more snow coming. Yep. Okay, that's making it even worse. I'm trying to gauge if my neighbors will be mad or not if I don't clean the front of my driveway. I I don't know the answer to that. Yeah. I think I'm just going to drive through it. How much of that burn take? That burn's going to take another... Oh, Wait, so you right. save this? I did. I saved it. Damn straight. I, darn straight. I saved it. I saw explosions on the screen and I was getting excited there would be some action. Sorry, bud. Yeah, that's true, Nick. Yeah, yeah, it's true. yeah, she makes a really good point. She does. She does. I just don't know if I want to stand out there and drag my snowblower back and forth and back and forth to clear it. Maybe I will. I don't know. I, hear, I still heard there's a lot of roads closed, so I don't know if I'm making my appointment with my accountant today. <laughs> Hire someone. No, I, I, That's a I, big I have an accountant to go to see. 12, 13, 14, 5. Oh, I'm not paying someone to do my snow removal. I'll do it. Dive this maneuver here at the ascending node. That could work. It's a little high on the Mun side, but at least get me back into the curve and orbit. Of course, the whole like minute burn. Yes. It's probably a horrible idea. Honestly, yeah. I agree. You agree? No, I, 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 I'm reading their chat. Snow is only dangerous if you don't respect it. That's for sure. Just because you have a four-wheel yeah. drive vehicle doesn't mean you can stop any faster. Nope. You might be able to drive through it better, but you can't stop any faster than everybody else. That's why my snow is cleared and I am sitting in my house. I have absolutely well, no was reason. Clear. Mine was clear up until the plow came through at 3 a.m. So. Yeah, no, I hear you. But I will... Uh... Yeah, I think I'm fighting this from the wrong side. I think I should be on this side of the equation, personally. Let's see where that puts us. Where is this guy? <laughs> I 
Yeah, I was glad when I heard that uh, work was canceled for the day. I was like, oh, I was like, yes. It's like, don't have to go through that snow, don't have to deal with any of that nonsense. But this other nor'easter, oh my god, god gotta be kidding me. Now we're gonna try this orbit right here. Well, this will leave us in an interesting position, I feel like. Taking your scientists for granted. Pilots. Taking your pilots for granted. Alright, let's just see. We got that note is in 26 minutes. We are going to warp here. It's probably going to take me a minute just to figure it out. Yeah, so I tried to fix add-ons this morning, deck, thinking I could get some of them working. And I did get some working, but then like I broke the life support one, which I'm not really sure why, but it wasn't working oh. to begin with because the parts weren't there, so. But I could guess I could live without the life support working. As long as... Well, yeah, I mean, if it kills off the Kerbals, that would be fun to watch. Yeah, well, right now it's not working. It's not taking into account that they consume life support. So I put it on the vessel, but for some reason... And let me, I guess let me just make sure that this is not that, it's not turned on. No, right, okay, I'll figure that out. Okay. We're going to burn it. 30 seconds to node and just hope for the best. I didn't wreck my orbit. So, we're going to warp up to here. Let's see. Now I'll do another maneuver here. Okay, there we go. Now we're getting in the, in the zone.
I could probably adjust that. Okay. Eight minutes, eight minutes, eight minutes, eight minutes, eight minutes. Just gotta check on Jebediah real quick. Make sure he hasn't, you know, fallen asleep at the keyboard or anything. <laughs> yeah, note in eight minutes. Got it. Check. He's been flying around for two days up in space. Jeb. Jebediah. Hanging tight. Got it, brother. Okay, we're good. Okay, back to Bob. Bob, hello, Bob. All right, Bob, seven minutes away from your maneuver here. It's positioned. Get us a little closer. Easy. Okay. Hopefully, I didn't do too much damage on that. Um. All right. That was like possibly horrible, but whatever. We'll add a maneuver here and hopefully correct that. Uh, correct it so we don't, you know, land on Mun. Cause that was never the intention. Ever so slightly slow this down. Right here. There we go. Oh, don't go that far away. There we go. Nice, super duper close flyby. Perfect. We're gonna fly by within 3,000, oh, except for the whole. Mm. You know, in hindsight, this might have been a really bad idea. Because <laughs> I am not sure that I can slow down. Enough. To make it back to Kerbin, but we are sure going to try. How much is that? Oh, crud. Okay, that's bad news. It's bad news. We need to slow down here a late way more and not try to mess around with the hole. Or we're never going to make it back. Poor Bob will be stuck in space forever. Bob will be lost in space. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Danger, 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 Will Robinson. I should change his name to Will Robinson is what I should do. Because 
I can fix it though. I can fix it. It's gonna be a one heck of an. It's gonna be one heck of a landing, but I'll have like 500 meters per second of delta v to correct my previous mistake. I think I can make that work. Sorry, Bob. Can't get quite close to Mun because I made mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. <laughs> Okay, hopefully Bob's getting some sort of experience out of this. Yeah, you know electric charge isn't being accounted for. Maybe because I don't have my, I'm not using an antenna. But whatever. Nothing we can do about that. Let's see. Let's get closer here. Four, three, two, one. And again, keep hitting the wrong button. Let's see what happens here. Oh, okay. We're okay. Not the end of the world. Not the end of the world. What's up, Mun? We'll land on you soon enough. Soon enough, we will land on Mun. Ugh. But not today. Closer, closer. We're getting closer now, that's for sure.
This could go horribly wrong, Deck. We might even lose a Kerbal on this one. This could, uh, this could be the end for Bob. Gotta slow him down. Coming in kind of hot here. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, Bob should have done an EVA. Bob should do an EVA. It's an EVA experience there. Should have done an EVA over Mun, totally forgot. Oh well. I'm moving fast, real fast. Real, real, real fast. Start slowing ourselves down here. I'm not sure I have enough fuel to slow this down enough, but we are going to give it a try. God, it's so hard to keep this thing centered. Man, truly underestimated what a pilot does for you. <laughs> truly, truly. Okay, well, there's that. I think I'm going to use the end of this rocket as a heat shield, though, personally. Oh, I am... Oh, there's going to be problems here. Yep. Oh, yeah, there's going to be problems. There's going to be problems. We're probably going to burn up on re-entry. Oh, no! No! Poor Bob. Did not make it. Oh, no! Bob was a good Kerbal. Didn't make it. Casualties. <laughs> Hope he didn't need anything. That was R.I.P. Bob. No, I mean, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, poor Bob. Poor Bob. Poor, poor Bob. Ah, it's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Not the end of the world. Poor Bob didn't make it though. Let's bring uh, let's bring Jebediah down and see how well his uh. Yeah, I thought so. Let's bring Jebediah down. He's been up for five days. Let's see Maybe what type of experience he's got. Yeah, Bob's like, well, Bob's dead, so Bob can't trust me anymore because there is no, no more Bob. Oh, Jebediah. Well, see, Jebediah is a pilot, though, so at least Jebediah can land himself. Like, there's a lot more stability control with with Jebediah. So you may need a two-man spaceship now. I do. You need science for that, though. I'm still bummed out that some of these add-ons aren't working. Ah, oh, it's okay now. It's alright. Not at the end of the world. I may try to do my Overwatch placement matches though, I'm not gonna lie. I might decide to switch this up a little. I want to take a nap. Yeah. I'm dreading going out and cleaning that driveway. <laughs> yeah, I'm not uh, I'm not excited about the idea. Fortunately, isn't it supposed to get warmer today? That's what I'm kind of waiting on right now. Is. Well, I mean, it's supposed to go up into the 40s. High of 40 by me today, so. Yeah. It's not gonna melt all the snow in the front of my driveway. No, it won't, but it might. Make but it'll it make a little less driveway better. Yeah. You know, make it a little less um, compact. It's not gonna help all the trees and wires down either. 
Nope. I just don't even know if I can drive there. I mean, it might take me an hour to get, you know, Wait. Oh, yeah. 20 minutes. I gotta go up to Baskin Ridge. Yeah, I gotta go. It's not far. It's usually only a 20 minute drive, but it could take me over an hour. My dad called and his his wife's trying to get to work since 8.30 this morning and she's still trying. It's almost 11 o'clock. I would cancel what you had planned and just save it for another Oh, day. yeah. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm thinking about doing. I think about just moving until the beginning of next week. Then we can go uh, just, you know, play Diablo all day if you wanted. <laughs> Diablo. Call them first and make sure they're even there. That's a very good point, Nikki. You should call them first and make sure that they're even there. They might be affected by power. They may not have been able to even yeah, reach no, out to I, him. I, I sent I sent my accountant an email and then thought about it. I'm like, well, if he doesn't have power, his computer's not going to be on it. He's not super tech savvy, so. But this day and age, everyone has a smartphone, so. I'm going to give him a little while longer. If not, I'm going to call. Chat. They're open because they're more north where I have to go and probably get more snow. You got this, Chivadaya. Piece of cake. A walk in the park. It's a walk in the park, Kazanski. You EVA'd before you go in, right? Make sure you got everything you needed? Uh, he's done an EVA report at least okay. once before. Oh. Okay. Quickly, Bob. Do this EVA. Boop. Thank you. I got my four science working, though, which is kind of what I was uh, specifically want. Or the Science X add-on, which tells you, like, what science is doable where. That was the, mo the most important of the add-ons I was trying to deal with because they don't have any ability to... Um, track science in the base version of Kerbal uh, in KSP, so. But once we get Jebediah on the ground here, we're probably going to uh, switch over to a different game. I gotta work so more on these add-ons later, because... There's a cut, there's a post on the uh, CFE's Reddit where someone used Kerbal uh, space program to build the pirate ship. <laughs> what? Funny. Oh yeah, that's totally doable. They actually even have some they have an add-on that allows you to make a submarine and um, do submersible stuff in, in Kerbal. It's actually pretty cool. Sorry, Dick. No death of Kerbals on this one. Just poor Jebediah mourning Bob's loss. The loss of Bob. Poor Bob. Poor, poor Bob.
windshield's gone. Taking a nice five meter per second drop, so we're gonna pop out the EBA real quick. Ooh. Odie's stopping at my house. Nice. Dropping off his extra video card that I can install on my PC. Why do you need an extra video card? Because I'm going to SLI two 980 Ti's. Because he doesn't need it anymore. That seems excessive. It is excessive, but I mean, he's now 1080, so he doesn't need the 980 anymore. That's a good point. I might as well get as many frames per second I can. I tried doing SLI and Crossfire, both platforms, and I, I've always had I had issues with like certain games just like really struggling with the the dual GPU support. I mean, granted, that was a while ago, so we'll see, we'll see. All right, and now we can recover this vessel. Oh, Might even get science out of this. A little bit of science, not a lot, but some. Sixty-five, no experience gain. Jeez, all right, man, make me work hard for that experience. I'll tell you what. All right, well, guys, this is the end of Kerbal Four today. I will work on these add-ons and see if I can stop breaking them. I'll be back in a little while to, I don't know, play another video game, whether that be Diablo or Overwatch. We will see shortly. So stay tuned.